Hi, this is Allison from Professor Drummond's Chemistry 1552 Honors. Um, here's a basic model wind turbine that I can use to show you basically how they work. The wind comes in here and spins the blades, and um, the blades spin the rotor shaft in the middle, and attached to the rotor shaft are a bunch of stationary magnets that create mechanical energy using these coils. The coils then transfer the mechanical energy as direct current into either a, the grid or a battery. And then the electricity can be used to power your house or whatever else you need electricity for. This particular one um, was made using PVC pipes that were curved or that uh, were cut and shaped to capture like the most wind possible given the size. And then this um, this part right here was actually taken from a treadmill. The treadmill took the electric current from the wall and used it to create the mechanical energy to use the uh, to to work the treadmill. But this one is doing the opposite. Basically, we're reversing the process by creating mechanical energy using the blades and the magnets, um, and then producing electrical current. Now that um, wind turbines are more easily understood, people have been able to make them um, in their own home like this and can use them to generate electricity for their own use.